Vowel Class. Welcome to today's English lesson. It says we can add different endings onto words to make new words. Can you remember the name for these? So last week on Monday, I think you were adding a s onto the end of different words like play, plays, run, runs. Today, we're going to continue with our work on suffixes. These endings are called suffixes and I bet you can remember some of them. So here's the root word play and let's look across the top line here. We've got play. Now we have plays. Now it's changed to playing. Now it says played. Do you remember we did that e and a d, that d suffix last week. At the bottom we have the root word help. Now it says helps. Now it's changed into helping, helping. And now it says helped. Today our new suffix is this here. And these two letters make this sound, uh, uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Here's that root word again, help, uh, help. So if we add the suffix er uh, onto the end of it, it doesn't say help now, it says help, uh, helper. Are you good at helping somebody? If you are, you're a good helper. If we moved it to the bottom word, so our root word is play, and then we've added er, uh, now it says player. You're a good player if you play the game fairly. Look, here's some children playing, and it says here, you can read it with me. Let's have a go. I can play. I am a good player. I am a good player. What about this one? Can you see? This girl has fallen over and this boy is being very kind. I think he's helping her. Let's see what he says. He says, I can help. I can help. I am a good helper. I am a good helper. Hmm. Okay, let's read this word. This is another root word. Ooh, I can see, I hope you've spotted it too, I can see a special friend. Do you remember this one? Special friend, I fly high. Do you remember it? Okay, so we've got special friend, I light, light. And it says here, this green pen is lighter than that one. Ah, I understand. This green pen here, this is lighter than this one. So lighter can mean when something doesn't weigh as much and lighter can mean it's a different colour. It's a lighter colour. This is light green, isn't it? And this one is dark green. This pen is lighter than that one. Mm, now we have dark. The root word is dark. And I can see a lovely blue sky there with white fluffy clouds. And this one looks like there might be some rain on the way. Let's read the sentence. It starts with that tricky word, the. The sky is dark, uh, darker today. The sky is darker today. Ooh, it must look like this. 
Read and write these root words. Add the suffix er and read the new words you've made. So at the end of every one, I want you to read the root word like we've just done together and then add er onto each one and think what new word you've made. Pause the video, have a go. So hopefully you've now made darker, you've now made lighter, I'm to put that in blue for us to see that suffix clearly. You've now made, so if you had help and you're adding the er, uh, hopefully you've got helper. And if you add it to the end of play, you've now got player. Okay. Now I would like you to write four sentences using these new words. Your first job will to be thinking of a sentence for each word. So what sentence can you think of with the word darker? Maybe choose something different from my idea. Do you remember I thought about the sky? So maybe think of something different. Ooh, what about hair colour? My, ooh, that's given me another idea. What about this one, lighter? So I used the colour green. Hmm, maybe there's another colour you could think of that's lighter than another. Player. Tell me who you know that's a good player. Maybe it's a football player. Helper. Tell me who is a good helper. Maybe it's somebody in your house or somebody at school that you know. Remember to check your work. Start every sentence you do with a capital letter and finish with a full stop. And that's the end of our English lesson today. Keep working hard, everybody. You're doing so well. OK, see you tomorrow for tomorrow's English. Bye.